Hello, preschool friends. It's story time. I thought today we could read this book. It's called Hug Time, and it's by Patrick McDonald. Let's see what it's all about. There once was a kitten so filled with love, he wanted to give the whole world a hug. Hug the whole world. Will that make it better? As Jules nodded, yes. Doozy helped with his sweater. There was no one this kitten wanted to miss, so he made and checked a hug to-do list. He hugged his best friends, Mooch, Noodles, and Earl. A butterfly, buttercups, a little gray squirrel. He hugged all the birds he could find in the park. So many to hug before it got dark. Jules jumped on a boat and set out to sail, and soon he spotted a big blue tail. What do you think it is? Let's see. <gasps> Attached to a huggable big blue whale. Would you like to hug a blue whale? I would love to hug a blue whale. The boat docked in Africa and Jules kissed the ground, the earth so precious, so fragile, so round. He hugged an elephant. And a chimpanzee. A giraffe. A hippo, a baobab tree, exploring the rainforest by foot and canoe, Jules discovered a species brand new. What do you think it is? Kneeling, he whispered, we welcome you. Off to India with its tigers so few, finding one is hard to do. He waited, he watched, he sat very still, he said to himself, I will, I will. <coughs> Did he do it? Purr, he hugged a tiger. Traveling on, he hugged a new. That's a new, kind of looks like a goat or a water buffalo. A panda. A peacock, a petite padu. That's a padu. I've never seen one of those before. Have you? A wallaby, a wombat, and a humu humu nuku fish. Remember, 306 on his hug to do list. This is actually the state fish of Hawaii. It's called a Huma Huma Nuku Nuku Apua. It's a long name for a little fish, huh? 
But at the North Pole, Jules sadly found what it would be like with no one around. Not a lot of people in the North Pole. Oh, no one's there. Sniff, how do you think she feels? So Jules was surprised when his tail got a tug and a polar bear asked, Would you like a hug? <gasps> oh. oh, that looks like a good hug. Polar bear hug. The world is so big. So big. And yet, so small. It's time that we embrace it all. That's something we all can do. Start with the one who's closest to you. Hug time! I just love that story. And I love hugs. I'm sad that I can't hug my preschool friends, but you know what? We can do what's called a ghost hug. It means I'm hugging you, but you can't feel it. So let's do it. Close your eyes, squeeze them real tight. Ooh, get a Sasha teacher squeeze. Can you feel it? <sighs> awesome. One thing you can do too is hug yourself. Let's try. Ooh, mm, I love hugging myself. It feels good. Mm, I'm gonna hug my stuffy. Mm, now I'm gonna go hug my dog. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'll talk to you soon.